Welcome to pre-math. In this video, we have got this uh, big uh, rectangle that consists of three smaller rectangles. The yellow one, the green one, and the blue one, as you can see in this uh, diagram, such that the area of this uh, yellow rectangle is 119 centimeter square. The area of the blue rectangle is 191 uh, centimeter square. This uh, yellow and green uh, rectangle length combined is uh, 9 centimeter while this uh, green and blue rectangle length uh, is uh, 11 centimeter and now our task is uh, to calculate the area of this uh, green uh, rectangle please don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe and please keep in mind that this figure may not be 100 percent true to the scale let's go ahead and get started and in this video, I am going to share with you with three different approaches. So therefore, please watch the video till the very end. And here's our very first step. Let's focus on this uh, green uh, rectangle. Let's assume the area of this uh, rectangle is uh, a centimeter square. And now we are going to find the value of uh, a. And moreover, let's assume that this uh, height uh, of this uh, big rectangle is uh, lowercase h then uh, this uh, height is going to be lowercase h uh, as well and now i'm going to show you the very first uh, method and here's our next step let's focus on this uh, yellow and uh, green uh, rectangles uh, combined their combined uh, area is going to be a plus uh, 119 isn't it and now let's recall the area of a rectangle formula area equals to length uh, times width and in our case uh, our dimensions are lowercase uh, h uh, and 9 for this uh, area so therefore we can write uh, a plus uh, 119 equals to 9 times lowercase h i am going to label this one as our equation uh, number one and now let's focus on this uh, blue and uh, green uh, rectangles uh, combined uh, as well. Their combined area is going to be a plus uh, 191. And once again, we are going to use the very same uh, area of rectangle formula, area equals to length uh, times width. And this time uh, our dimensions are uh, 11 and lowercase uh, h. So therefore, I can write uh, a plus 191 equals to 11 uh, times uh, h. I'm going to label this one as our equation uh, number two. And here we are ended up with these uh, two equations, equation one and equation two. And now we are going to subtract. And here I have copied down equation one and equation uh, two. And now we are going to subtract. So therefore, I'm going to change this sign to negative, negative, and negative. And we can see that this uh, a and minus a is gone. When we subtract on the left hand side, that is going to give us uh, 72 equals to 2 times uh, h. Let's divide both sides by 2 to isolate h. So therefore, our h value turns out to be 36. So thus our height uh, h turns out to be 36. And now let's focus on this uh, equation one. And here I have copied down this equation one. And now I am going to replace uh, this uh, lowercase h uh, with this uh, value 36. As you can see in this uh, next step, I have replaced this uh, h by 36 value. Let's simplify. That is going to give us a plus 119 equals to 324. And now we are going to subtract 119 from both sides to isolate uh, A. So this is gone. So therefore, our area A turns out to be 205 centimeter square. So thus the area of this uh, green rectangle turns out to be 205 centimeter square by using the very first method. And now I'm going to show you the second method. And now let's focus on this uh, equation one that we came up uh, in the previous step. And here I have copied it down. And now I am going to divide both sides by 9 to isolate uh, h. And here we can see this 9 and 9 is gone. So therefore our height uh, h is going to be equal to a plus uh, 119 divided by 9. 
let me label this our equation uh, number uh, three and now we are going to focus on this uh, equation two as well and here i have copied down equation two and now i'm going to divide both sides uh, by 11 to isolate uh, h so therefore we can see this 11 and 11 is uh, gone so therefore our height uh, h is going to be a plus uh, 191 divided by 11 I'm going to label this one as our equation uh, number four. So we ended up with these uh, two equations, equation three and four. And now we are going to compare these two equations. We can see the left hand sides are identical. Both of them are lowercase h. So therefore we can equate uh, the right hand sides uh, as well. So therefore we can write uh, a plus uh, 119 divided by nine is going to be equal to a plus 191 uh, divided by 11 and now we are going to cross uh, multiply so therefore we are going to get uh, 11 times a plus uh, 119 times 11 is uh, 1309 equals to and on the right hand side we're going to have a 9 times uh, a plus uh, 1719 and now i am going to move this uh, 9a on the other side and at the very same time i'm going to move this uh, 1309 on the other side as well and if we simplify we are going to have uh, 2 times uh, a equals to 410 let's divide both sides by 2 to isolate uh, a this 2 and 2 is gone so therefore our area is going to be 205 centimeter square so thus our area for this uh, green rectangle is going to be 205 centimeters square by using the second uh, method. And finally I'm going to show you the third method now. And now let's focus on this uh, green uh, rectangle. Let me label uh, this uh, length uh, of this uh, rectangle as uh, lowercase a. Then this uh, side is going to be lowercase a as well. And we know this whole uh, length is uh, 9 and this uh, length is lowercase a. So therefore uh, this uh, length is going to be 9 minus uh, a. And likewise uh, over here this whole uh, length is uh, 11 and this uh, length is uh, lowercase uh, a. So therefore uh, this uh, blue rectangle length is going to be 11 minus uh, a. And now let's focus on this uh, yellow rectangle. And now let's recall once again the area of rectangle formula. Area equals to length uh, times width. And in our case uh, for this uh, yellow rectangle its dimensions are lowercase h uh, and 9 minus a. And its area has been given to us uh, as 119. So therefore I can write this thing as uh, 9 minus uh, a times uh, lowercase h equals to 119 i'm going to label this one as our equation uh, number uh, five and now i'm going to divide both sides by nine minus a on this side and nine minus uh, a on this side as well to isolate h and here we can see they are gone so therefore our h value turns out to be 119 divided by nine minus uh, a and now let's focus on this uh, blue rectangle and we are going to use the very same area of rectangle formula once again and in our case uh, our dimensions are 11 minus a and uh, h and the area has been given to us as 191 so therefore i can write uh, 11 minus uh, a times uh, h equals to 191 let me label this as our equation uh, number uh, six and now we know that our uh, h value is uh, 119 divided by 9 minus a i am going to substitute it over here in equation six as you can see in this uh, next step. and now i am going to remove this fraction by multiplying both sides by 9 minus a on this side and on this side uh, 9 minus a as well and here we can see this 9 minus a and 9 minus a are gone so therefore we ended up with the 119 times 11 minus a equals to 100 
91 times 9 minus a and now I am going to distribute uh, these uh, values and now I am going to move this uh, 1309 on the right hand side and at the very same time I am going to move this uh, 191a on the opposite direction as well as you can see in this uh, next step. So let's simplify that is going to give us uh, 72 times uh, a equals to 410 and now we are going to divide both sides by 72 to isolate a and on the right hand side if we reduce this thing that is going to give us uh, 205 divided by 36 so therefore this 72 and 72 is gone so a value turns out to be 205 divided by 36 and now let's focus on this uh, equation 5 and here I have copied it down equation 5 and now our a value is 205 divided by 36 I am going to replace it uh, over here as you can see in this uh, next step and now let's focus on uh, this uh, inside parentheses uh, numbers and here I have copied it down and if we simplify this one that is going to give us 119 divided by 36 so therefore I am going to replace this whole uh, thing by 119 uh, divided by 36 as you can see in this uh, next step I have replaced this whole thing by simplified one uh, 119 divided by 36 and now I am going to multiply by its reciprocal 36 uh, divided by 119 on this side and I'm going to multiply 36 divided by 119 on this side as well to isolate H so therefore we can see this and this is gone this and this is gone so therefore our h value is going to be 119 and this is gone so h value turns out to be 36 here's our final step now we are going to calculate the area of this uh, green rectangle and now let's recall the area of rectangle formula once again area equals to length uh, times width and in our case our dimensions are uh, 205 divided by 36 uh, and 36 so therefore i can write uh, 36 uh, times uh, 205 divided by 36 and we can see this 36 and 36 is gone so therefore the green rectangle area turns out to be 205 centimeter square so thus our green rectangle area turns out to be 205 centimeter square thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos bye